A case in point, recent street repairs in downtown Bakersfield. 17 Cecilia Trevino has more on what business owners are asking from city officials. Cecilia? Jim, it's been months of construction between O and Q Street in downtown Bakersfield as the city works on water pipes and storm drains. But business owners say they are left to wonder every morning if customers can get to their stores. The sound of construction, something no one is eager to hear. That's become a daily thing for business owners in downtown, specifically on 19th and 20th streets between O and Q Street. Soledad Baltasar opened her business in September, and since then, construction has not finished. My thing that I've been upset about, I think more than anything, is that we do have all different types of people that come in, especially our disabled. They haven't been able to drive in, and it's not... You know, it's not fair for them to have to walk all the way down the street just to get here. With the no signage announcing businesses are open, Baltasar has been hit hard. Well, I've had people that drive around, they're like, we've driven around like four or five times. I've had people leave me messages, you should just close because no one can even get to you. With no back door to her business, access is limited for hers and other small businesses. Just one block away, Adventure Awaits, now named Postcard, is in the same situation. We know we don't got any paper from the city, like news, uh, no, we, know, we don't know anything about the construction. Yeah. Do you know how long it's going to be going, if it's going to expand? Actually, no. I don't have any information about that. When it's going to be finished, exactly, I don't know what it's going to be. <laughs> what it fixes, I don't know. The noise especially affects Postcard, since people look for a calm and quiet environment. In the end, both business owners agree construction is beneficial, but wish communication improved between city officials and the community. We asked the city about this and they shared a release sent in December which stated road construction should have ended a month ago. No word yet on why the projects have taken longer than expected. In studio, Cecilia Trevino, 17 News.